Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Today, Indian Army has inducted the indigenously developed 10 meters short span bridge in the presence of Chief of Army Staff General M.M. Naravani and Chairman of DIDO G. Satish Reddy during a ceremony held at Delhi Cantonment. The first production lot of 12 short span bridging system or SSBS 10 meters have been inducted today. The research and development establishment Pune, a premier engineering laboratory of DRDO, has designed and developed the system in association with Larson and Dubro Limited. The short span bridging system is a mechanically launched bridging system of MLC 70 load class to bridge small gaps and canals. The unique feature of the system is its compatibility with existing bridging system to enhance flexibility in negotiating water obstacles. It enables army to pick and place bridge over gap and quickly construction of bridges with minimum crew. The SSBS 10 meter plays a crucial role of bridging the gaps of up to 9.5 meter as a single span providing a 4 meter wide fully decked roadway ensuring faster movement of the troops. The 12 bridges are part of 102 SSBS 10 meter from Larson and Tubro which is the production agency. The project short span bridging system involved the development of two prototypes of 5 meter SSBS on Tatra 6x6 chassis and another two prototypes of 10 meter SSBS on Tatra 8x8 re-engineered chassis. Both the systems have undergone rigorous Directorate General of Quality Assurance or DGQA testing, met and user trials and after successful completion of all the trials, the systems were recommended for induction into the services. This bridging system is compatible with Sarvatra bridging system 75 meters where the last span requires covering a gap less than 9.5 meter. The developed bridge is of load classification of MLC 70. MLC is a military load classification and the number correspond to it is derived from the parameters such as weight, spacing of vehicles, safety factors and dynamic effects or impacts. The NATO system uses 16 hypothetical classes which is multiple of 4 that is 4, 18, 12, 16. 20, 24, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 120 and 150 as defined in the STANAG 2021. This system will help in the quick movement of troops and enhance the mobilization of resources. The DRDO has vast experience in developing critical combat engineering system like military bridging systems. Number of mechanized mobility solutions for the Indian Army like single span 5 meter and 10 meter, short span bridging system, 46 meter modular bridges, 20 meter BLT T72 and multi span 75 meter Sarvatra bridging system, etc., have been developed. Manually launched 34.5 meter mountain foot bridge was also developed by DRDO earlier. These bridges have been widely accepted by the Indian Army. The Raksha Mantri Sri Rajnath Singh has congratulated DRDO, Indian Army and the industry on successful development and the induction of the system. He stated that this induction will give a boost to the fast growing Indian defense industrial ecosystem and help the industry to contribute towards the Aat Nirbhar Bharat. Chairman DRDO Dr. G. Satish Reddy congratulated the teams involved in the successful development and induction of this bridging system into the Indian Army. This was today's update. 
Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.